Guys, this is Mr. Joshy J, and in this video, I'm going to talk about Chelsea Football Club being sanctioned. Yes, now, I just think this is so harsh on Chelsea Football Club. They are literally being punished for uh, political reasons because of one man in Russia. Yes, I mean, Chelsea can no longer sign players. They had to close their merchandise store it's an absolute nightmare i mean some people are gonna lose their jobs because chelsea are now owned by the uk government it is absolutely unbelievable how a club like chelsea is owned by the uk government it's not right yes i know i'm a manchester united fan and i should be bantering chelsea and be happy around this so no, I'm not. I think in the circumstances, it is very sad what is happening to Chelsea Hall Club. I really do. I really do sympathise. And my thoughts go out to them, all the Chelsea fans, all the people involved at the club. Well, who say not Roman Abramovich, but everyone else at the club, you know. My thoughts just go out to all the fans... People working for the club, everyone involved. It's just, it's a dire situation. It really is. I mean, look at this. I, I got the Chelsea shirt on DH Gates. One I recently reviewed on my YouTube channel. Look, see, it's got the Nike number three logo. Hold on, I put it down like this. You'll get more of a view of it. Yeah, see, look, number three, the Nike logo. And if we pull out on that and Nike, I mean, that shirt is just going to look bland as fuck. It really is. I mean, you got Hyundai on the sleeve, like. I mean, I only bought this shirt to review a rival's kit. And I thought I'd just keep it in my collection. But obviously, if a Chelsea fan wants it, they're, they're welcome to it. But it's just a nice shirt to have in my collection. But... What on earth is that shirt going to look like if we pull out and Nike pull out? I mean, it's just going to look so bland. I mean, my goodness sake, absolutely unbelievable. I mean, and only season ticket holders can attend games. I mean, what the fuck is this all about, bruh? What on earth is going on? I mean, the situation is just absolutely terrible. It really is. Just imagine how I would feel if Manchester United was in this situation. Like being taken over by the UK government. I wouldn't know what to do myself. I'll be completely just on the knife edge thinking, wow, we won't be able to bring anyone in. Only season ticket holders can go to games and that. It's just like, wow, unbelievable. So my thoughts really do go out to Chelsea Football Club. I really don't think it's fair at all that they're being punished due to one individual in Russia. Yes, I mean, it's just a joke. It really is just what the government are doing is absolutely ridiculous. Yes, like I said, I'm a Manchester United fan and I should be bouncing up and down. But no, I'm not. I mean, I'm a Manchester United fan, so probably... Loving it, how Chelsea are now in this shit. But not me. Under these circumstances, it's just not right. It's not fair. I mean, look at the trophies Chelsea won over the last, like, 19 years. It's been unbelievable. But now, they won't be able to renew contracts. Like, Rudiger is out of contract. So many players are out of contract to Chelsea in the summer. And they won't be able to... Renew them. Abramovich cannot sell the club. I mean, just... Wow, where do Chelsea go from here? It is a dire, dire situation for the club. It really is. And I really hope they find a way out of this thing. Because I know a couple of Chelsea fans on YouTube, you know, Eunice Talks Football. Amazing guy. I've been subscribed to him for quite a few years now. Even when his original YouTube channel was around, Eunice HH, he was absolutely top draw in Chelsea fan. Chelsea fan CV, you know, listening to Mackie, Leone, 
Lewis, you know, all them Chelsea fans, just, they are top class Chelsea fans. They really are. I mean, my YouTube subscriber, F1 Fan Gamer, what a classy Chelsea fan he is. He always has respect for Manchester United. So that's what I like about F1 Fan Gamer. But, you know, yeah, look, my thoughts go out to your football club in Chelsea. They really do. I really hope you find a way out of this. Really do. Comment your thoughts down below. I will always reply. And yeah, let me know what will happen to Chelsea next. Where do you think they go from here? Love to hear your guys' opinions. And if there's any other football clubs you want me to talk about, comment below because I've spoken about Rangers and Everton this week. Now I've spoken about Chelsea today. So let me know down below what football team you like me to comment on next. Bye-bye.